one story comes to mind from when I was around nine or ten, if that. I was playing in my street and a group of young men ran past like and um, a few minutes later some police came round and they asked me where they went so I pointed in the direction because I didn't know anything about like being a grass or anything I was just helping but a while later somehow they knew that I told them One of the boys come up to me and he starts threatening me. I was scared shitless because he told me that he was going to slice up my throat and kill me and show my mum like my dead body. I was too scared to tell anyone at the time. So. I remember another time I was scared in Glasgow was when I was around 15. I was in town. I was just by the Clyde under a bridge hanging out with my friends but at one point I got separated from them because I started exploring. out of nowhere they start chasing me and I start screaming. I'm running as fast as I can, I'm screaming and eventually they stop chasing me but those few minutes were some of the longest of my life because I thought I was dead. Because there's been reports of around that area like people being their dead bodies thrown into the Clyde after they're used. I see all too often on Facebook and other social media apps that like new people are missing every day. And it's like it's such a common occurrence here. can be quite unstable. Like, there's definitely an alcohol and drug problem. Definitely. Because even... I see drug deals all too often as well. It's, um, you, you learn to spot it. It's a certain handshake. the murder capital of Europe. <laughs>